everyone welcome back to my channel today I thought we do a 12 by 12 Valentine's scrapbook layout the paper that I'm using today is actually from American Crafts It's from the open stock section at uh, Joann's it does measure 11 and a half by 11 and a half for my next piece it does measure 11 and a half by three and a half and this paper is actually from this stack pack it's a uh, die cuts with the view the prim rose and this I purchased from Michaels uh, sometime last year but the last time I went they still had it so this is from Michaels for my next piece I do have this cloud border this is actually from the silhouette store it does measure 11 and a half by 2 inches next I do have a grass border this is also from the silhouette store it measures 11 and a half by 3 quarters now for the rest of my pieces, they're all going to be from Little Scraps of Heaven. I do have my spooky fence. My fence measures 11 and a half by one and a half. And I did ink all my edges with my Stampin' Up! Early Espresso and I'll go ahead and glue it down with my Zip Dry. And for my fence, I actually did not ink the edges. I left it as is. And for my cloud border, I did ink the edges with my Stampin' Up! Marina Mist. Next, I'll go ahead and back this on a 12 by 12 craft cardstock paper. Next, I do have my photo frame. My photo frame measures seven and three quarters by six and a half. And on my silhouette, I did do an internal offset. For the inside layer, it does measure four and three quarters by four and three quarters. And the same thing, I did an internal um, offset. And you know what? This is actually from the silhouette store. So sorry about that. <laughs> I know I mentioned um, everything was going to be from Little Scraps of Heaven. So this tag is from the silhouette store. And over here, I did put a little journaling card. And this is actually also from the stack pack that I just showed you from Michaels. It actually comes with a lot of little journaling cards. And I kept forgetting about them. So I kind of just uh, took them out of the stack pack so I could kind of see it more often. It has like little postcards, a chalkboard. I'm really liking it. And again, I had completely forgotten about it. So I had cut it off from here.
Next, I do have two trees. The trees measure six and one quarter by two and three quarters. And everything has been paper piece. Next, I do have a little gift bag. My uh, bag measures two inches by one and three quarters. I did pop it up on one thickness of foam tape. And this was a recent, um, maybe not recent, but it was a freebie a while ago. I think it might have been, I don't remember, but I really like it and it's a gift bag. Go ahead and put it right here. Next from the file, the kiss, kissing booth, I do have a little boy and a little girl. For the boy, it does measure five and three eighths by three inches. For the little girl, it measures five and one quarter by three inches. And that's the measurements without the heart. Uh, I did pop them off with one thickness of foam tape. And also um, on their nose area, I also popped it up on one thickness of foam tape. Now for the little hearts, I just took I duplicated the present, removed the bag, and just enlarged the presents a little bit and just gave one of them to each. Uh, gave each one of them a, a heart. Now I did alter this file a little bit because on the kissing book file, she you she doesn't have a bottom part. She only has a top part, she's behind the booth and um, he's there without pants and I believe he has money in his hand. So you guys know how I feel about SVG files without clothes, it just makes me ew. So I decided to go to other files from Little Scraps of Heaven and I came across my um, apple of my eye file, I believe it was called. I took the jeans part from a different file, put it on top of him altered it a little bit and then I think it looks pretty good after that I just duplicated and gave her pants as well <laughs> so if you can kind of see it's kind of the same thing I just didn't give her the bottom part and I think they look okay next I took his little heart uh, duplicated and made two little hearts. They do measure three and three quarters by three quarters. Go ahead and put one over here, one over here. And from a different file also, I forgot which one it was, I have uh, two daisies. For the daisies, they measure uh, five eighths by one and one quarter. And I know I mentioned I altered these bears. Honestly, it did not take a long time at all. It was actually quite easy. I did this layout um, in less than a day. And uh, for those of you who follow me on Snapchat, you guys really seem to like <laughs> this um, the two bears. I got a lot of replies on this one. And um, I know one of you was surprised to know that, that the bottom part didn't have the jeans. So it's totally doable, quite easy actually. Good enough. Hmm. Hmm. I might put the hearts there. I think that looks cuter. <laughs> if you guys hear my son, <laughs> they're in the room next door. I told my husband I wanted to um, 
to film a couple of videos and he said sure no problem I'll take the kids to the other room and they're all watching Winnie the Pooh it's all about Winnie the Pooh right now <laughs> but I could hear my son all the way over here It's so funny, I showed my husband the layout uh, before I started recording and he was like, oh, that's so cute, what is it for? And I looked at him and I'm like, it's for Valentine's Day, you know, it's next Friday. And then he just looked at me and I, I asked him, did you forget? And he's like, oh, I kind of did. <laughs> so I was like, okay, no worries, this is just a nice reminder for you. I usually request uh, no presents just for him to take me out on a date because it's so f hard for us to um, go on dates because we it's hard for us to get a babysitter that's not my mother I don't like to take advantage of her since she already takes care of my kids during the week when I work uh, so it's very hard for us to get a babysitter because of my son since he does cry a lot um, sometimes yeah, it's hard for us to get a babysitter. So I usually just say, oh, just take me out on a date and find a babysitter. <laughs> Let's see what he ends up doing. And there you have it. This is my 12 by 12 Valentine's Day scrapbook layout. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day and I hope to see you soon. Thanks so much. Bye for now.